I'm Daisy Hall reporting with UBTV News at Bristol's Reclaim the Night and this is part of a national campaign um, in order to fight against gender inequality and violence against women to ensure that women have a safe space. This is Sally Patterson, organiser of the Reclaim the Night event. Why do you think this is such an important issue? I think there's a recent tendency to think of sexual assault, sexual violence as a thing of the past. And the reality is, it's happening every day. It's happening behind closed doors. It's happening on campus. It's a huge widespread problem. And our aim tonight is to basically show that Bristol will not tolerate gendered violence of any sort. So why are you here at the march today? Well, I guess you only have to watch the news at the moment to realise how much of a problem sexual assault still is. It emphasised how inclusive feminism is and how uh, what it aims to do. We want girls to feel like they can be safe walking home at night, like just as safe as guys can. I'm here because I don't always feel safe on a night out and I don't think that that's right or acceptable and I don't think it should be something that we just take as a matter of fact. I think our right to exist in public spaces is questioned a lot by people who are like, oh, why were you out that late? What were you doing there? Um, but I think, what are you wearing? wearing? But I think, yes, public space has been only reserved for men for like a very long time and I think there's still some bits of that that are still implemented in our society and that we need to get rid of. This is Finn Mackay and you uh, initiated this whole Reclaim the Night event. Why is Reclaim so important today? Well, Reclaim the Night is sadly still really relevant. I mean, we're in the midst of this global Me Too phenomena that we're witnessing with women in all sorts of occupations bearing witness and giving testimony to all the sort of levels of sexual violence. So it really couldn't be more relevant, really, to be marching this year to say that women should have a right to use their town centres, their city centres, to feel bold and to feel safe in their own city centre. It should not be too much to ask. As long as women can't really freely use their cities without looking over their shoulders, being scared, getting the last bus home. We can't really talk about women's freedom to engage in all the things that this beautiful city of Bristol has to offer.